Hey guys, so today on Tractor Tips, I'm gonna show you how to connect your controller to mix LR and broadcast live on the internet to all your friends. So for this tutorial, we're gonna be using the Control S4 power adapter, USB cable, and then two RCAs. One RCA we will need for the main output to the speakers. And the other RCA is for connecting it to MixLR. So how do these work? Well, this RCA has um, some quarter inch jacks on one end and RCA on the other. And this will go into the, uh, the jack output of the S4. And then it will also go back in to the input one and two. So it literally just connects from the output back into the input. And it's input one and two that that goes to. The other one is from the main output to the speakers. My speakers are wired up to the main mixer, which is a DJM 600. So I will connect it straight into the line on that mixer so that I can hear what I'm mixing there too. So once we're all connected up, Let's move over to the laptop. And let's go ahead and load a track into Deck A. And then we can go and open up MixLR. It'll first ask you to log in with the details that you've already uh, set up on uh, the MixLR website. And then we need to make sure we can select our audio source. So you get a list here and you can select channels one and two. And then let's press play on the controller. And we can see that you do have here in the top, there is some, uh, some noise displaying. Let's just skip through the track a little bit here. And you can see that you are receiving sound. So that's it. It's all set up. Then what we need to do once we're once we've got the right audio source set in, we can go back to the broadcast section and hit start broadcast. And then do a little bit of figuring out and then it's, it's going for it. Now, if you want to record your set, you can leave this on and it'll record your set so that you can play it uh, on MixLR afterwards as well. So now you're broadcasting live, you want to tell everybody about it. And so you can share it to Facebook, Twitter, and even some Facebook pages there as well. Or you can just go ahead and copy the link and uh, fire it out to wherever you want to. And then you can just send out a tweet. And you can compose whatever message you want to write inside the tweet there or on Facebook. So great way to get broadcasting. And uh, once you've finished your broadcast, you can save it to your showreel, as I say. Um, but we're not going to do that on this one. And that's how simple it is to broadcast to MixLR. We'll see you on MixLR.